y'all, it's your girl CC coming back at you with another one. And today I'm going to be talking about self-care Sunday. Um, doesn't have to be Sunday, it could be whatever day you want, but I always pick one day to just promote self-care, self-love, pamper yourself just a little bit. So yeah, I promote self-care on Sunday nights because it's before the work week's about to start back up. I want to be 100% when I'm at work, I want to feel good. So I pamper myself on Sunday nights. And I do this by doing a couple things. One of the major things I do is I take a bath on Sunday nights. So two of the things I use in my bath, this um, stress relief, or I've used a different kind, but Bath and Body Works um, bath soak. I've used a lavender one, but um, my mom recently got me the stress relief, eucalyptus, spearmint, bath soak. So. I actually put it in a cute little jar. So I put a couple scoops. Put about one or two scoops in my bath when I run that. And I put on Avon Senses. I have a sensitive one and this is the lavender. I use the lavender because lavender is just a soothing, calming, stress relieving scent. So I like anything lavender for this kind of self-care. So with that, I take a bath. While I'm waiting for my bath to run, I usually do facial, start my face things. So I start by taking off my makeup with coconut oil. I switched it up, y'all. I don't use baby oil anymore. I use coconut oil. So, take a tissue. get a good glob and I kind of just grab it. I'm not wearing a lot of makeup today, but it's so gentle. And it's mostly my eye area that I have to worry about, so just getting all that product out for my eyes. Mascara, eyeliner, because if I don't get this completely off before bed, it stains your pillowcases and it's a burden to get out, to say the least. So I do that. To start me off. You may think I'm done, but I'm not done. Roman cleanser. Still use this and I wash my face. Again, I'm focusing on my eyes area as well as the rest of my face. So normally on Sundays after my bath, after I've used my face brush, wash my face after the bath, I use a mask. But since I'm now trying out my derm roller, I'm going to be derm rolling this Sunday. So I'm going to clean the brushes I'll be using, well, the brushes, the micro needle heads I'll be using. I'll be using the smallest one for my face and the bigger one for my legs for um, stretch marks. So I'm going to fill this with hydrogen peroxide. So it can soak while I'm soaking. And in the bath, I'm gonna be using my Aveeno Positively Nourishing Calming Body Wash. Also lavender, has chamomile. It's just relaxing, nice in the bath. I also like to put on a certain playlist while I'm in the bath. Um, it's with the Google Play app. It's called Velvet Voices that one velvet voices it's just very soothing and i light some candles so yeah bath time anyway on to the next step for my face which is my vanity planet brush So I'm going to use a new T 
Today I'm going to use the um, silicone brush head. Okay, so this is going to be my first time derm rolling. So doing my face, so I'm going to use the smallest thing. And it says to do cross hatching. So. Feels kind of weird. I don't know if I'm pushing hard enough, but I'm scared too. <laughs> it doesn't really hurt. Now I'm going to use my Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula um, with Vitamin E Skin Therapy Oil Face. Um, I've always seen people use oils and stuff after they derm roll. They say that maximizes the results and this is supposed to be, you know, have retinol and vitamin C and anti-aging. So I'm gonna... Okay, now I'm going to try, I'm not going to show you this, but I'm going to use the big guy on my stretch marks, on my legs and stuff. I heard it works, so I don't know. I'm scared. But if it does, that's awesome. Gonna just try it on my side ones. And if those go away, then I'll try other places. And I also heard that this might help slightly, but that's not proven. And I end my self care Sunday with some stress relief moisturizing lotion, and then I go to sleep. And that's basically all I do for self care Sunday. I take a nice bath, do some facial stuff, um, candlelight music, and I just relax. Um, sometimes in the mornings I'll do yoga, just like, you know, take out time to care for yourself. Basically, just you are important, you are the only one that knows what you like and what really makes you relax. So, you know, make that time for yourself and do that. Um, you won't regret it. Just once a week. If you can't do once a day, do once a week or every two weeks. Just take time to relax and just pamper yourself um, and love yourself so yeah that was today's video I hope you enjoyed it please like and subscribe um, put out new videos every Monday and Thursday I'll be talking about hair a little bit on Thursday um, so yeah have a great week guys bye